Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sam. Uh, before you watch this video, I want you to uh, read this reading material so that you can have better understanding of the video. And if you are done reading video, and let's get started uh, the video, the reading material, then uh, let's jump into this video. Alright, so we are going to talk about matrix initialization and basic matrix operations today. So, uh, first of all, we can initialize a matrix with a zero matrix. Here, we we define the matrix size 3 by 3 using a size object that we learned in the last video. And here we can put the size matrix here and using uh, then also we will have the just one channel uh, and then we will we can define the uh, zero met, uh, the matrix with uh, zero matrix zero matrix so let's check it out so it takes some time wait for some time and here we get the uh, uh, zero matrix and second initialization method is uh, with one matrix so we are going to use the same size as earlier we used and uh, yeah using size and what we can use the, the key, uh, function once from the met uh, actually it's a method of the met object and we can uh, initialize the one metric so let's go over the next line and here we get the uh, matrix with uh, all value of ones and the, uh, the last initialization I want to talk about is uh, identity matrix so using I method from the uh, met object uh, we can uh, define a matrix with identity matrix which uh, I mean whose diagonal uh, components are all uh, one so let's check if this one is working so here we can see all diagonal components are one and uh, secondly we want to uh, go over the base matrix operations such as matrix addition, matrix subtraction, and elemental wise matrix multiplication, and uh, regular uh, matrix multiplication. So first of all, let's go over uh, matrix addition. So using this plus symbol, you can uh, perform the matrix addition. So let's say we have two identity matrices like here and result and we can get the result met. So let's see if this one is working properly as we expect. Uh, there looks like something is wrong. So let's remove the previous breaks breakpoints and let's run again. And here as we expect uh, 1 plus 1 is 2 and each uh, diagonal components are uh, 2 each diagonal component is 2 and second uh, let's uh, take a look at matrix subtraction and uh, once again we are going to use two identity matrices and using minus symbol here uh, we will uh, able will be able to perform matrix subtraction so let's see like here this is the result so each diagonal component is zero and here uh, let's uh, look let's look at uh, elemental wise matrix multiplication it means sim uh, simply you multiply uh, each component uh, from two matrices so this result matrix uh, matrix met one was two by two and we are multiplying two uh, 
uh, these same matrix matrices so we are expecting like four 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 and the, the rest of the components are zero and let's see and you can do that using this mold function uh, actually mold method of the math object so let's see if this one is working and once again i think it got stuck at some point so let's remove the breakpoint here this one here and run again so as we expect we got four 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 for the all diagonal components and the rest of parts uh, are uh, zero values and uh, lastly i want to talk about matrix multiplication so uh, let's say we define uh, four by two one matrices here and two by four one matrices as uh, temporary mat two and if we take a look at they will look like this so four by two and two by four so you can perform the the matrix multiplication using uh, this symbol asterisk symbol so um, yeah let's see if this one's working properly here we go so we get the uh, matrix with uh, all values of two like this all right that's it for uh coding part so um lastly i want you to do simple exercise to practice what we will learn today so basically i'm asking you to write the code to calculate given problem so there are like simple matrices and you need to use uh matrix addition and uh, subtraction and multiplication so and also i'm giving you uh, expected answer like this so after you code up uh, a c plus plus script you you need to check if your result is the same as this one and lastly uh, i want to give the uh, hint of this problem we haven't learned how to initialize this type of matrix manually. Luckily, there is the there is a way to do that uh, using this input stream uh, input streaming operation. You can manually uh, define uh, matrix like this. All right, that's it for today. I hope you learned something from this video. And basically, we are uh, ready for. Uh, computer vision project uh, in the next video so yeah let's see in the next video bye bye